Hi, this is Born in 62, I'm Henrik Jørs. There are lots of models that describe human behavior. Why we think what we think, what, why we behave, say, do what we do. And all of these models are there to make us conscious about ourselves, to understand ourselves, to understand others. And these models I use a lot and I love a lot of these models. I work as a coach and uh, models makes it easier to talk about what have passed and what we want to do in the future. So all in all models are great. But there can be a downside sometimes. Most of these models are made describing what normal people would do. Not the insane, but normal people, and you could say standard people, average people, like you and me. And sometimes people can get such a model wrong and say, hey, what I did, I just have to do. I'm a human being, and uh, this model says that in a given situation like this, I will behave like this, and I did, so I'm excused, I can't do anything different. And that is not what the model is there for. Actually, it's the opposite right way around. You could say it's like that you have some kind of action. Someone pushes your button and you react. And sometimes this reaction is good, supportive, constructive, and uh, will help you, will help others, and all is fine. There's nothing wrong with that. And other times we say stuff, we do stuff that we later regret. In my past, in my youth, I have done a lot of shit, sorry, that I have uh, lived to regret afterwards. Sometimes you regret, you regret something because of shame, sometimes because you hurt people you care about, and sometimes you just re regret it because of the consequences. Maybe you are right when you tell your boss that he is a stinking asshole, sorry, but uh, the consequence, being fired from your job, well, you kind of regret that, so it would have been better if you didn't say anything at all. So what we really need sometimes is to be able to stop this action, push bottom, reaction stuff, and put a stop in between and be able to say, hey, I'm a human being, I have a free choice. So you step back one step backwards and look at the situation in a third person perspective look at the situation, look at yourself and say, I have a free choice. I don't have to react like I was being pushed on a button. I'm not a monkey. And this is actually what you need to understand about these models. They describe an average situation, but if you always react like that description, like you are supposed to do in the model, then you're just a monkey in a model. So what it's all about is actually being able to be conscious about yourself, your own emotions and what drives you, and then sometimes be able to stop the situation, take that step backwards and say, hey, I have a free choice. I'm not talking about changing yourself. You're not going to become Dalai Lama. Uh, I'm a skeptic and I think that uh, even though Dalai Lama is a great person, it also helps to live in a monastery up in the mountains. If he had to ride the subway every day into an office building filled with half-crazed managers, maybe he wouldn't be such a nice person. So it's not about changing yourself or having some goal about being perfect. I know that in my future, both in the near future and in the years to come, I'll say stuff and maybe do stuff I'll later regret. Even though I would wish I didn't, but it will happen to me as it will happen to you. We are not perfect, we are human beings. But I hope that every day I'll be able to sometimes take that little step backwards and have a free choice, not just do something because someone pushed my button, but actually take the time being conscious about my own emotions and step back and say, stop, I'll do something else. I'll not react. I will do what is best for me, what is best for the people I love. And that is what it's all about, not changing yourself, but being the best version of yourself. So it's not a journey towards a goal of being perfect. It's a journey every day about being a better version of yourself. 
So this is what it's all about, not being a monkey and a model, but being a human being who have a free choice. In coming videos I will talk about how you can manage your choices and how you can manage doing this kind of stuff. But until then, try not to be a monkey. Hi.